onion. <laughs> you know, you can't make steak without onions, okay? Even though they got red onions, I could use like a sweet onion, but that's okay. We gonna go with what we got, okay? We making steak. Y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all, TikTok made me do this, okay? I got this recipe off of TikTok, somebody's uncle somewhere, and I say that that thing looks so good. I was like, okay, we're going to do this with this steak. So, guys, before we get started, welcome to my kitchen. And like always, hit that intro. And these are our beautiful ribeye steaks. Got my potatoes and onions and everything. We're going to go ahead and season these steaks up. They are all different sizes. I got them from Walmart. So, yeah. Some pepper. Let me say all steak. Oh, you need salt and pepper. Your preference. Steak got a half flavor. So yeah, like I said, TikTok made me do it. There's a lot of recipes on TikTok, guys, that um I look at, but it's not a lot of them that I want to do. You feel me? But this one here. Yes, Lord. I wanted to do this one. I like, oh yeah. Let's do this one. Let's make this one happen. Take my tongues, spread that in. Flip it. Season them again. I got my pan on high, and an iron skillet is to unchange these things. It's the best way to go ahead and burn up some steaks. Okay. Get these things flavorful. If it don't look a certain type of way, you ain't do what you're supposed to do. All right, y'all. I'm going to take y'all to the stove. All right, y'all. And I'm cooking this on high because I want to burn them. I'm not, I just want to sear them. And I got an iron skillet way bigger than this. We're going to do three at a time. So I got more to season. And I got them on high to get them nice and burnt in this iron skillet. And I got a little bit of oil in there. Y'all, this is my steak. Remember, we're not cooking them all the way. I just want to make them, you know, stir. Not black enough, y'all. I want a nice sear on it. 
a nice beer. Okay, guys, at this point, my steaks are done. We see all this stuff at the bottom. This will help us get our gravy. So we, they're not done yet. We're going to pile all the steaks in here. Okay. That's all, y'all. This is a TikTok recipe. There are a lot of TikTok recipes I don't like to try. I'm trying this one. Come on, Jack. Now, what you gonna do? We're we gonna take some beef broth. Let's just throw it one low. And I'll pour some beef broth in here. And let it cook in there for like 10 minutes. Turn the stove down. And let it simmer all up together for 10 minutes. And that's why I'm gonna switch it to a non-stick pan. I'm gonna switch it to a non-stick pan in 10 minutes, add my peppers and my onions. Then we're gonna let it simmer and cook like for an hour and a half. We're gonna add some red potatoes. Look at that. I'm gonna put a top on it and we'll be back 10 minutes. Simmer. Hold on. All right, guys. Like I said, my sons, they went shopping for me. And they got red onions. So we can use a red onion. You wanna get your, while your 10 minutes is full of the while your 10 minutes is going, go ahead and chop up your veggies. And how much vegetables you use, that's on you. And I'm saying, you know what your family like, what they don't like. So my family, they down with the onions and stuff. So yeah. See how I did that? No seed mess. Cut the top off, which I'm gonna be using this part. <laughs> And just and, and take that seed, take that whole seed stuff out of there. Take some of that flesh out. Look at that. You ready, this is ready to be stuffed, y'all, with some rice and hamburger and all that. Yeah. So while your um meat is cooking, start chopping those veggies. And y'all, like I said, I got this from TikTok. TikTok. I saved it. I thought it looked so good. A lot of those TikTok rest be like, okay, suspect. But I was okay. I was like, okay, this steak. It came out tender. It's looking like a roast, but it's gonna taste like a steak. Let's let's make this happen. Let's make this happen. Now we're gonna chop up my pepper. You can do your peppers any way you want. And you can use whatever peppers you want to use. Um, red. I always, I always, I always go to the green. I don't know why. Who go to the green more than the the multicolors? Always go to the green. And it's Sunday, and y'all get the video on Monday. But comment below what you guys prepared for dinner on Sunday. Now the size is this. I'm making some box macaroni and cheese and a quick Caesar salad with some croutons. Um. Parmesan shaved cheese and lettuce. That's how quick this meal is gonna be. Cause it's all it was all about the steak for me tonight. It was all about the steak tonight. So you know, I'm like, hey, it was whatever. My sons, they go to the store. They fans with red, um, sweet red onions or purple onions that we wanna call them. They would say, why you want to get the, um, yeah, I'd be like, I'd be grabbing a bag of onions, you know. So since they got a whole bag, I wasn't spending no more money. We using what's in the house. There we go. And we're going to chop up these onions. And look at all that off. I like that all that off my onion. That first layer. Who does that? See, there we go. All right, this onion ready to be chopped. That's just me. I always do it with my onions. That first layer, I'll be like, nope, you got to go. I'm just going, ooh! See, and these red onions are slippery, dog. I almost lost a finger. 
but in the world, I'm going to give me a chocolate. I'm going to chocolate big old. <laughs> That's what I told you. <laughs> I told you. Oh, man. <laughs> Look, I'm a home cook. I'm not the best chopper in the world when it comes to onions and peppers and anything. I just, I do what I do. All right. I'm going to chop these up a little bit more. I'm about to make my transfer. It's been about 10 minutes. I'm about to make my transfer to my aunt, still to my non-stick so that we can add our peppers, the rest of our broth, and let this cook for an hour and a half. We got some um, red potatoes. Rinse them off, chop them up, throw them inside there, and let them cook like for another 40 minutes. And while all that's doing, I'm going to boil my water for my macaroni. And this is just to let all this stuff, all that goodness in the bottom of this pan turn into a gravy without adding any flour, she said. Okay. Okay, guys. I got my nonstick pan, and I'm gonna take my time and start pouring all of that goodness into here. And what I'm gonna do at this point, and this is gonna buck cook for like she said two hours. I have an hour. I'm going to, um, I got an hour 30 minutes, I'm going to throw my potatoes in there. So right now, I'm coming with my green peppers. I'm coming with my green peppers and onions. <laughs> oh. Again, as much green peppers and onions as you want. It's up to you. I'm not finished. Okay. Now you take the rest of your chicken, your um, beef broth. I'm sorry, guys. I said chicken broth. Rest of your beef broth. And you're going to pull the rest of your beef broth. They see you recording. He recorded for TikTok, y'all. Up to TikTok. My real, my short. I'm pulling all of it. Turn your stove on a medium. This is going to make the gravy. After an hour and 20 minutes, top this on medium heat. I'm going to add in these red potatoes. Okay, guys, this I had the timer on. This one's balling. And you know what? Crazy thought is that isn't this like pepper steak? I said, Dodo, you did pepper steaks before. Why are you tripping over this video? But I don't know. Girl, y'all, I remember the old. Um, but yeah. <laughs> but it is. We added in these um, red potatoes. Yeah, and yes, it did make gravy without using flour. So I did like that tip. But now, we're adding in these little red potatoes. I think we'll use the little regular red potatoes. But I opt out to use these little teeny baby red potatoes, you know. And I'm going to add some more seasoning on top of here because... It's nothing like flavor. Okay. You don't want no bland food. It almost like pot roast. I don't know. But I got my water on. Put macaroni and cheese. Andre, wash off my lettuce. Y'all need me one of those um lettuce spinners. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about? One of the things to spin lettuce. I'm just going to put this all down in there with the meat. 
and the potato on the stove. And let this cook until the potatoes are done. And which is not gonna take them long. Cause these these little teeny potatoes. I'm gonna let it do another hour. The girl cooked like two and a half hours. Yeah. Okay. Water on for my macaroni. That water right there is on for the macaroni. I'm making some crap deluxe. Add in some chicken flavors, onion powder, garlic powder, extra cheese, a little bit of milk, so top macaroni and cheese. It's gonna be fine, y'all. Comment what you cook today. It's Sunday, but you watch this video on a Monday. All right, y'all. Told y'all this ain't big Sunday dinner, but it's something. Okay. Make a Caesar salad. I need a, sh a salad spinner, y'all. You know, cause I gotta. I'm about to stick this in the um. In the in the um. What's that thing called? Calendar strainer, and wash it off. You gotta wash your lettuce. Try to see this one. I feel like this right here be feeling kind of extra gritty or something. I don't know. But I can like feel the grit on my hands or something. I don't know, but I'm gonna wash this off. This is a quick Caesar salad. Let me go wash this lettuce off. Come back and put this together. The macaroni is already in the boiling water. And it's just some box macaroni. Nothing special. All right, y'all. There you go that. This is my lettuce. Got some Texas Toast croutons. Again, nothing special. Some um, shaved Parmesan cheese. Oh, this is a brand new one. Thought I had one already open. We might have used it. But we didn't have salad three times, two times, three times already. I'm going to show y'all this potatoes and steak because it's ready. And what I do, I just, I'm going to take these tongs. You don't get all your flavor. Mm -hmm. You don't get your flavor from your, um, your flavor from your dressing. And that's it. That's a whole bag. So that's it for that. So y'all, look at this. And it made a gravy. And this is done and ready. Thanks, TikTok. Now, only thing I did different, I did add about a half a cup of water. I did do that. But this is about to cut off. But this is ready. Put the top on it. Finish up this macaroni and we're gonna make this plate. All right, guys. I got my macaroni here again. This is stove top macaroni. I'ma add some pepper, because we like pepper. I like pepper. What's this? A little bit of garlic. Just a teeny bit. Everything has to have flavor, y'all. A little bit of onion. And I always pick in whew, condensed chicken. Condensed cream of chicken. And not even a whole lot. I got two boxes of macaroni. So. Whew. About half a can. And. About a handful of Kobe got. I 
Oh, I give me a little bit of milk. So we be right back. A little bit of milk, right, y'all. There's a little bit of milk. I want full, just to loosen it up. That's all. <sighs> this is my stove top macaroni. And cause you know I got the regular cheese packages that came in here. How much extra cheese you wanna put in it? That's up to you and your fam. I would have add some sour cream, but I don't got none. Ooh. Mmm. That's good. So let me make this plate. I'm finished. Comment, what's your Sunday dinner? My family loves my corn cheese. Stove top box. When I do a box, it's always either they'll be this shells or crab deluxe that's it all right let me make this play all right so squad this is dinner we got that steak and potato over there stove top mac and cheese Guys, like, share, subscribe, hit that bell to be notified. And a quick, nice Caesar salad. What you gonna top? Caesar dressing or ranch, blue cheese, vinaigrette? What's your favorite dressing? Y'all, this is dinner on a Sunday in my house. TikTok made me do it. All right, guys, go follow Soul for Tea Vlogs. Go follow um, Humble Spirit, New Life Journey, my sister, content by Leo, my sister. Sun, Deron TV on Twitch. Everybody doing something on the internet. And oh, don't forget the cookie guy, Michael, my son. Hey, he made this good chicken um um Alfredo piece of man. Go check out his video. Sunday night dinner. Love you guys. I am out.